Okay, baby dolls. Just need to get put the game window back on. Okay, baby dolls, and start. I'm um, continuing with our mission on Winter World Dizzy to um, find the remaining five ice cubes, which are more than likely all hidden behind various items in the scenery. And how will we find them, I... How will we find them, I hear you ask? With a lot of painstaking searching, you know. Going through the landscape with a fine tooth comb. Turning over rocks and what have you. Even though I don't actually think there's rocks in this game. But you get the picture, don't you, Sonny Jim? And if I haven't said so already, Merry Christmas, even though it's the 27th of um, December right now, and oh yes. Better late than never with the Christmas wishes, though, is it, Cesare, baby Jules? Yes, sir, Bob, it is. And now, yes, um, we get back to turning the landscape upside down in our intrepid search for the ice cubes that are hiding away from view from us. And they could be anywhere. They could be hidden behind pieces of tree trunk. For instance, those are the kinds of places you would never imagine coin, I mean, ice cubes to be hidden, aren't they? I suppose even in a really zany kind of way, the ice cubes could be hidden inside the bushy mane of a lion. And by the way, have you noticed how the lion has a latter M for his eyes in a way? Oh, you know, for the whites of his eyes that go around the pupils of his eyes, it looks like a letter M. Makes me think of McDonald's and all. <laughs> yes, it does. I don't think we can um, really search this uh, torch, no. It seems familiar to me there's even been times when um when parts of clouds have hidden um have hidden the uh, collectibles like ice cubes as well, so if we get really desperate we're going to have to search uh, all the ice cubes, aren't we as uh, I mean all the clouds, aren't we, as well as Every last bit of snow that's on the map since, you know, if you're desperate, that, if you're desperately searching, then even snow could be uh, hiding ice cubes. But no, in this case, it was another uh, bunch of leaves that was hiding the ice cube, wasn't it, Sunny Jim, eh? It is. Indeed, this can be a most deceptive world that we live in sometimes. But in a way, people say that has to do the, over the overall charm of life, doesn't it? But at least now we're one closer. To our ultimate goal of 25 ice cubes. Yes, sir, Bob, we are, yes, indeed. I suppose if you're getting desperate, you could say there's even places like um, 
Oh, there's left a land. That's half um That's half a uh, lots of snow stacked up on top of each other. On top lots of uh, bits of snow stacked up on top of each other. Could be hiding uh, ice cubes as well, put on it. Maybe that'll make Maybe that'll make a paranoid freak out of me. And obviously such uh, such a predicament isn't good for someone with OCD like me, is it? But we can't be picky and choosy in regards to our circumstances in life all the time, can we? Some of the time maybe it's okay, but... If I like that all the time, sooner or later, people will identify us as complainers and whiners and emo types. And next thing you know, our reputation is in tatters, isn't it, silly Jew? That's obviously not the kind of thing anyone would want in this day and age. No way, Jose, is it? Whenever I worry that I've missed a spot, that also adds to my stress and um, and uh, potentially triggers my OCD in various ways. And I can't drop the railing there. But I can drop it there, so yes, everything turns out fine and dandy in the end. Yes, sir, Bob, it does. I wonder how much time I've got left and when exactly I started. I think it was about, um,. Maybe half an hour on the timer down in the bottom right there, but uh, maybe it was also just over half an hour. And another thing that I'll be doing soon, more than likely, is taking um, suicidal jumps from clouds. Like the one down there, for instance, in all directions to try and um, ascertain if there's any uh, mice cubes on sneaky screens that are out of reach in various places that we would never have known about otherwise. But yes, I'm doing well, aren't I? Up to 22 um, ice cubes right now and all. How little bits of flame can dangle, can um, appear above um, big jets of flame like the ones, like the main ones that you get at the base of torches, like with that torch we have on screen there, doesn't it? In a way, it makes it look like the little bits of flame. The little licks of flame on top are floating in the air somehow. A most intriguing phenomenon on indeed, isn't it, a sunny gym? A 
I'm just checking the tree bark now to make sure there's no ice cubes are hidden behind them. Almost anything is a possibility in this day and age of duplicity and deceit. And all those other things, all those other nasty things which we would never want to fall victim to but so often do. Yes. Sometimes in dizzy games, um, when you're wondering what to do and seeking out what you should do, sometimes you'll accidentally even jump onto invisible platforms. So that's an, another example of how, just how deceitful and tricky dizzy games can be, isn't it? Sometimes I think that might be part of the reason why I play modern games in such an obsessive way like Fallout New Vegas and sometimes I'll look at every little bit of the floors thinking there might be sun sunset stars, sarsaparilla bottle caps in various places because I'm also a big achievement hunter and um, part of me thinks that an achievement uh, um, Part of me thinks that there might be an achievement involving uh, finding a certain amount of um, sunset sarsaparilla bottle ca star bottle caps because if um, if you find fifty, you get um, you you get let into a kind of um, treasure room in in the. Um, Corporate headquarters of the um, Sunset Stop. If the Sunset Sarsaparilla headquarters in New close to New Vegas, but um, but but when you talk to the machine that uh, counts the that counts the Sunset Star Sarsaparilla bottle caps you found throughout the throughout the course of the game there's also an op uh, 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 and uh, when, when it decides um, whether you have the 50 bottle caps or not that you need in order to uh, um, get in order to win yourself the treasure um, when it says that you have got enough, you get a notification that comes up saying uh, saying that you've failed a mission, even though um, even though you're being let into the um, what do you call it? Yeah, the kind of treasure room, I suppose you could call it, of the Sunset Sarsaparilla headquarters. And, um, that makes me wonder if maybe you need to find a really high amount of, um, of Sunset Sarsaparilla bottle, star bottle caps in order to, you know, succeed with that mission which you fail with all the time, but, um, Another part of me thinks it might just that quest that I'm talking about where I always fail might just be um, kind of like um, to do with the um, game that he offers you to play with him. Um, from the, the impression I get is that it seems like some kind of a gambling game or something. I'm not sure really. 
And uh, given that I haven't played the other gambling game in Fallout New Vegas, I think they call it Caravan, um, I haven't played the gambling game that, um, that the Guardian of the Sunset Sarsaparilla Treasure Room offers you to play with him just yet, because um, I've just always kind of assumed that, um, you know, that'll be, it'll be the same as the Caravan game that he offers for you to play with him. Or if it isn't, well then that could be the something to do with the um, the quest that I'm always failing, doesn't, doesn't it? Got a little bit excited then when that conversation started, thinking maybe he had an extra ice cube or something that he wasn't telling me about. After all, these kinds of sneaky things can happen in dizzy games, can't they, eh, Sunny Jim? Yes, sir, Bob, they can, yes. Feeling like I'm running out of time, but found another ice cube, which is great, isn't it, eh, Sunny Jim, yes. Now to search every inch of these roof tiles as well. After all, I've kind of got a fear that um, I'll end up with 24 uh, ice cubes again and I'll be dallying around for ages in the end, confused, wondering where the last one was and not knowing what to do like I was um, like I was the first time I ever completed this game or oh, oh, the first time I was trying to complete it I should say yes oh so now that screen above is just called sky pretty funny eh? like they couldn't really come up with a fitting name for it so I guess now that um, I'm getting well and truly desperate for the um, ice cubes, um, that now I'll need to start making um, wild, desperate jumps from the clouds to um, to to try and find the um, ice cubes, yes. This can of course be very dangerous and so um, if I lose all my lives it very well could end up being a part 5 to this video which um, would indeed be a shame wasn't it considering... Uh, but I lost a life finding that silver ice cube. Still, finding one is better than not finding one, isn't it? So here we go. Finding the ice cube, yes. And now let's hope if I jump from this ice cube I won't run into that bat. No, this, that's good, yes. So, um, I'll say we've got like five minutes or so to, um, find the last ice cube. Which could be very hard indeed if, uh, um, if, um, it ends up being as taxing as, um, as it always was before for me, well the last times I was playing that is, yes. In fact, I think I'm gonna try another daring jump from off the side of the treehouse screens. Probably won't do me any good since I've already jumped from the very highest vantage point, haven't I? But as I say, desperate times make for desperate measures, yes. I suppose, um, 
there's a way I could get up to those higher ledges, those higher platforms up there. Sometimes in dizzy games, for instance, yeah. Oh no, that was cheating! No, oh, it made me fall from the air to uh, when I regained my last life, to, to so that I could get bitten by the bat twice. Yeah, that's cheating, I say. So ridiculous. Oh, um, there's going to be a part five, I guess, because... Because, um... Because, um... What was I going to say? Yeah, because there's no way I'd be able to play all the way through to where I was in just five minutes then. And since my videos, I try to strictly make my videos half an hour. Well, um, you know, that's, um, that means it's impossible for me to, um, you know, um, play all the way through the game again and, um, Get those 24 ice cubes that I need, and then get to, and then find another when I have no idea where it is, isn't it? Yes. So that means the end of this part for now, and possibly a part five soon. Yes. So in the meantime, we leave this cozy little. Title screen where all the characters are urging us to try again. And I say goodbye to all of you fine folks here. And if I find out you're laughing at my failures, I'll give you an online owning at some point in the future. So you better watch out, Sonny Jims and Sonny Jimettes. Yes, sorry, Bob, you had. So, yes, in the meantime... Goodbye.